Hello everyone, this is Aladdin from Miami Solar Pump and today we're going to take an in-depth look at different submersible pumps we have in the market and discuss their advantages and disadvantages in different usage scenarios. Next to me we have four submersible pumps and assuming that they are they are all have brushless DC motors we're going to see how they differ from each other in terms of design mechanisms. These two are centrifugal pumps and these two are helical ones. The centrifugal ones, they pump the water from the inlet through the centrifugal force generated by the rotating impeller and they are suitable for large flows and low, low pressure. While the helical ones lift the water through the rotation of a helical which produce a lower flow rate and a higher pressure than the centrifugal one making them suitable for high head and low flow scenarios. It is especially uh, energy efficient when it when when the head is higher than 50 meters what is the difference between those two centrifugal ones well the first one has uh, plastic impellers which makes it uh, not resistant to water and uh, it can only work in um, pure water while the other one has a stainless steel impeller which makes it more durable and works in uh, impure water and uh, difficult environments now let's take a look at how those two screw pumps differ from each other the first one the helical type one from yami uh, this design of stainless steel uh, drive shaft is added between the motor and the rotor uh, which can withstand high torque almost no damage in normal use and of course a longer life but the hollow rotor design does not only reduce vibration but also makes the pump uh, operates more energy efficient so this helical submersible one is relatively cheap but the performance is not as much good as yami helical rotor one by comparing centrifugal submersible pumps with screw submersible pumps and introducing uh, yami helical rotor one we hope that you will have a full understanding of the suitability of each product in different situations. Remember, if you need low level pumping with high flow rates such as below 50 meters and higher than 10 cubic meters per hour, a centrifugal pump might be a more appropriate choice. While for high head, deep well or high level pumping with low flow rates such as above 50 meters and less than 6 cubic meters per hour, a helical rotor pump is a better suited to your needs. If you're considering energy efficiency, fewer solar panels, and lower energy consumption, Yami Helical Router Pumps are the right choice for you. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and a subscribe. And if you have any questions, please leave us in the comments. Thank you. See you next time.